Hello, my name is Gabriel from GAPAC USA. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install and make work the HyperTech. Because sometimes the people from Blackmagic, even if you call them, they will say, well, uh, yeah, do this, do that, but they will not tell you the basic. So after a few days uh, working with this device, I found the workaround to make it work. So I'm going to show you step by step so how you can make it work. Another th uh, thing that you have to do is this. You have to push uh, the display button and then with this you move until you see setup and then you press set, set again and then you can choose DHCP or static IP. I suggest you always to use static IP. Uh, in this case it's static as you can see so this is the IP I'm using, this is the, the gateway and once you have everything in place you press again uh, display and then this is what you're going to see. So make sure that you have this button, it has to be on, the one that says REM, REM it, it, I think is means remote so that is very important. Now I'm going to show you on the computer what you have to have in order to make it work. Also, another thing is the input. So make sure you are using the input that you want to use because if, you, if not, if you're using something else or you don't have any image, so that is very important. It will not uh, start recording or doing anything like that. So make sure, in this case, I'm using SSD, I mean, I'm using SDI, SDI and everything and make sure you have that. Okay, here I am on my Mac. I'm using Final Cut. You have to open terminal and you have to ping the device. So if you can ping it, it means that it's going to work. Otherwise, it will not work at all. Okay, now we are using ATM software control. So there are a few things that you have to do in order to make it work. First of all, you have to click there where you see the little gear. So I'm going to click over there and then you will see this. Once you see this, you have to set up, uh, you have to choose HyperTech as you can see over there. And then you have to write the IP. So once you have the IP and you have this check mark that is on green, it means that everything is okay. So now that you have that, we're going to cancel and then you have to go here where it says a uh, media player, hypertech, and you will have this option. You press and then you start recording. And if you want to stop, press again. And if you want to play, uh, play back, you can do that as well. I hope this solved all your issues. If it was like that, click like. Remember one more thing that I forgot to say. If you are having some issues that you're doing everything that I show you and you don't see it and, or it doesn't work or something like that, you don't see it on the software, what you can do is unplug just the HyperDeck and leave it on the other, the, the switcher, and then plug it back in and it should work. So that is one small trick that I almost forgot to say. So remember, subscribe and see you next time. Bye.